What is up guys? Today we are playing episode 3 of Car Mechanic Simulator. Alright, so we got this car today. Um, so what we've got wrong with it is the car is hard to control. None of the parts have been discovered. So we're going to take it on the track if we can. And we have poor brake performance. So we've got all those as well. So taking this out on the test track should help us let's have a look yeah we can take it out there so by taking it or we can examine each partly some parts though do you require you to do this little test so let's just do this we'll break the customer's car while we're at it as well pull the handbrake spin it out a few times the customers like I hope my car's not damaged while these idiots are trying to fix it. <clears throat> the good thing is though that none of the damage actually sticks so that is fantastic so that just there would have destroyed the front bumper completely but um, in Car Mechanic Simulator we don't have to worry about that. Alright done. So we just got to bring it back to the shop now. In the car model now. Alright, so we've got our outer tie rod is at 7%, sway bar, front end link A is at 26%. Um, I'm pretty sure, were they? Yeah, so they were part. So we still got one part to discover as well, so that's going to be a hard one. Alright, so we'll move this car over to the left lifter. Uh, we'll chuck in our little mode here so we can already see some red parts in there it's the ABS module I'm pretty sure there ABS we've got good brake stuff there brake stuff at the back doesn't look like to be anything on the left hand left hand side oh that sorry that would be the driver's side forgot we're working on the American cars here Let's get this up, and we'll start on the front of the car to start with. Uh, we'll start with all this wheel stuff over here. So we'll just remove everything. Yeah, so that's definitely needs replacing. So that was at 13% the brake calipers. The brake pads are 71, that's not bad. I think we had to keep everything above 69 so it's yes yeah, it's, it's perfect all right so we'll take off this part pretty sure your yeah, outer tie rod needs replacing it looks like the steering rack needs replacing as well it's it needs to be taken off the car to exam so we just need to pull apart the whole car just to get that bloody steering rack all right let's just take off the other wheel they don't make it easy. Oh, that definitely needs replacing. So we'll just need to pull apart the whole braking braking system there. Three percent, jeez. This guy was literally running on nothing. So we'll take that inner tire rod off. Move that inner tire. Um, I'm pretty sure we. Got, have we got? Oh, we're missing the tire rod there. Steering rack is at 28%. So I think we found all the parts now. Yep, we did. Uh, brake caliper is all done. ABS module as well, which is over here somewhere. There is it. Yeah, there. Alright, so we'll just. Obviously, ABS module we can't get to yet. Um, we'll grab that bad boy while we're underneath the car. Oops. So ABS module still red, of course. Uh, nothing was wrong on the driver's side, not the passenger side. And we just needed to move this part over here, and that seemed. Everything else is fine. Uh, we 
probably need to get rid of the brake pads as well there. They're at 20%. Alright, let's go. That's everything we have. Let's go over here. Let's have a look. Um, so we'll sell everything from our last job. Just trying to make sure we're not selling current parts. Alright. So we need a brake caliper, brake disc, what else? So we need two brake, brake discs ventilated. Right, so we'll buy those because I'm going to forget what we need. So brake. We need two of those. Ready charging the customer an arm and leg. Um, so we've got those two. We need a brake caliper. Was there other brake? We need two brake calipers. Um, so we got brake caliper, we got that, don't need that, outer tie rod, was there other, yep, so we only need the one, I keep doing that by accident, outer tie rod, uh, steering rack and sway bar, so steering rack and sway bar was the A1, but I'm not going to do this again because I did it last time and it was the wrong part. It is the A1. Thank God. Um, do I get... We need one brake pad as well. Might as well get the ABS modular while we're over here. Ooh. It was the modular, wasn't it, that needed replacing? Ah, we'll come back for that. Uh, just because the parts are very expensive, I don't want to don't want to buy it if we don't have to. All right, let's start putting this all back together. Assembly mode activated. Screw that bad boy in. Put a, why, why not just put the hundred percent ones on this wheel? I don't think it went there, but it doesn't matter. Who cares? Chuck our brand new steering rack on as well. Uh, chuck our inner tie rods on. Yeah, well, you can you can have the uh, brand new one on this side. Everything can be brand new on this side. So just chuck the new wheel in. Um, all right, that seems to be everything on that side. Put our new brake pad on, right there. Oh, not new, but we'll put our new brake calipers on. We're just randomly putting new parts everywhere. Sway link there can go on nicely. Perfect. We're missing anything there? Yep, we are. We're missing that inner, oops, inner tie rod there. And the outer tie rod there. All right, so we just put that wheel back on. Screw all that shit in. Now we'll run to the back of the car. Don't run in the workshop, guys, though, because we will fall over on the oil that's all over the place. Put that on. Tell the customer that we need to replace the brake, all the other brake pads in about two months' time. Alright, so that should be everything. Yep. Yep, and then just the ABS module, which we need to access from the engine bay. Um, there it is, that rusty thing. Ugh. People who are coming into these rusty-ass cars. <coughs> Alright, so just triple check that that is the ABS module. Yep. Alright, so now we just go spend four million dollars on this guy's car. Thank you, that'll be twenty-five grand. So my charge out rate at the moment is six thousand dollars an hour. I had to do a full engine rebuild for your tires. I'll buy that. Um, Alright, that's all done. So our third job's all completed. $3,821 US. So that translates to be like $3 Australian at this stage. Fantastic, we're rich. Alright, 
that's all for this episode guys thanks for watching we'll be back with episode four we're going to go to the telephone and figure out what our next job is it's going to be a mystery for episode four let's find out thanks guys for watching don't forget to subscribe and like the video and also my facebook is in down the links in the description below thank you very much and as always we'll see you guys next time thank you